Do you have a sales process for your spa? Hi, I'm Dori Suka, founder of Inspiration Management. I'm here today to discuss the importance of having a sales process. You see, most spas who reach out to us for help don't have a very clear sales process. How about you? In this Spa Biz TV episode, I will share with you four steps to having an effective spa sales process. First, you must have strategies to generate qualified spa leads and prospects. A focus on generating leads is often a missing strategy. I asked this question during the Leap Ahead seminar. What is your lead generation strategy? Most spa owners don't have a solid answer. So the first step of a sales process is to know how many leads you need to generate per month and how many of those you can convert into a first time visitor. You must know these numbers. How do you generate spa leads? Well, you can generate leads or prospects from your website by having them opt in, having opt in opportunities such as register to win, subscribe to a newsletter, ask an expert, or receive a complimentary gift card. These are all ways to motivate your visitors to give you their information. You can also generate leads by participating in business to business events, going to a trade show, or going or doing a Facebook campaign. There are many ways to generate leads economically. The important thing is to do it. You need to set a goal as to how many leads you need to generate and implement strategies to help you reach that goal. Generating leads is half the battle, but once you obtain the lead, you must implement step two of the sales process. So step two is to begin building relationships, building trust with that new lead. The second step is to build trust. We want to show them that we can help them look and feel better, that we can offer value, we can offer advice, we can educate them on health, wellness, or beauty. How can we accomplish building trust? Well, we can set up an automated relationship building sequence that can consist of emails, direct mail, phone calls, invitations, or other things. Third, we need to convert the lead into a first-time visitor and a client. One way to convert the lead into a client is to invite them in for a tour, a consultation, and or a trial. You can offer them a trial gift card, which they can redeem towards one of your treatments. This first visit is very, very important. Your team needs to pay very close attention to the details, and they need to know this is a first-time visitor. You need to wow them. Make a great impression and conduct a great consultation. Fourth, we need to convert that first-time client into a lifetime client. So the, consul the consultation should lead to creating a customized program to help them reach the results they are looking for. It should lead to multiple future appointments. Once they complete their program, you can then present a membership program to help them maintain their results. Setting up a sales process will help you become much more aware of what needs to be done for you to reach a higher level of success. So I encourage you to evaluate your current sales process and improve it. Improve it by implementing these four steps. So need help creating your sales process? Call us or write us. We will help you create a great sales funnel for your spa and your business. Like this episode? Share it. Until next time, stay inspired.